Hello class 3rd students. I hope you are all doing well. Today we are going to start with the chapter 16 that is our environment. And the main points are environment and pollution, saving environment and clean surroundings, air, water, soil and noise pollution, chipko movement and tree plantation. So class let's start. Take the living things and cross the non-living things. Here you can see the pictures and you have to take accordingly. Environment. All things in our surroundings makes our environment. We have living and non-living things in our surroundings. Plants, animals and humans are living things. Air, water, land, rocks, buildings etc. are non-living things. All these living and non-living things have an effect on our environment. For making our life comfortable, we are using many things in great amounts, which is making our environment polluted. Pollution. Pollution is an act of making our environment dirty. Pollution causes harm to our health too. We make our environment polluted by our wrong activities. Air pollution, water pollution, land pollution and noise pollution are different types of pollution. Air pollution. Air pollution is caused by making the air dirty. Some of our wrong activities that pollutes air are smoke and dust coming from factories. Smoke from vehicles, burning of garbage, cutting of trees. Here you can see the picture of air pollution. Air pollution causes harm to eyes, nose, throat and lungs. It causes diseases like asthma, headache, allergy and other respiratory diseases. Water pollution. Water pollution is caused by making water dirty. Some activities which cause water pollution are as follows. Flowing of drainage water, garbage etc. in the water bodies. Flowing of factory waste and chemicals into water bodies. Bathing animals and washing clothes in water. Oil spills from oil tanks. You can see water pollution. Drinking polluted water causes different diseases like cholera, typhoid, diarrhea and jaundice. It also causes harm to skin. Polluted water affects plants and animals also. Soil pollution. Land on which we live is also being polluted by some of our wrong activities as given here. Dumping garbage beside the road or on open ground especially plastics, polythene bags, food, vegetables, metals and electronic goods. Cutting off trees that causes soil removal from the land. Excess use of fertilizers and pesticides on crops by farmers. Soil pollution causes many diseases and growth of cockroaches, rats, flies, etc. It also causes disease in plants and animals. Food grown on the polluted land causes health problems. Here you can see the soil pollution. Now, noise pollution. Loud sound that is unpleasant to hear is called noise. There are following reasons of noise pollution. Loud sound of loudspeakers. Loud sound of vehicles, trains, aeroplanes, etc. Blowing of horns and bursting of crackers. Loud sound of machines, factories, etc. Loud sound of music, etc. Noise pollution causes hearing loss, headache, sleep problems, heart disease, etc. Here you can see noise pollution. Saving the environment. We can save our environment by taking the following steps. Here are the steps. Stopping the cutting of trees. Plantation of more trees that makes air fresh and clean. Using of CNG in vehicles in place of petroleum and diesel. Using air filters in factories to prevent air pollution. Using cloth and paper bags in place of polythene bags. Treating factory and drainage water before flowing into water bodies. Using different garbage bins to collect dry and wet garbage. To follow three R's. Reduce, reuse, recycle. Reduce, 
to reduce waste, reuse, to use some waste again, recycle to make a new product from the waste. Clean surroundings. If our surroundings are clean, our environment will be clean. We should keep our house or rooms in it and area around it neat and clean. We can cover doors and windows of our house with net. Waste should be thrown in dustbins. There should be separate dustbins by the side of the road for biodegradable and non-biodegradable waste. Leaves, plants, flowers, waste food, etc. are biodegradable waste. These can be converted into manure for plants. Plastic metals, etc. are non-biodegradable waste. These can be recycled and reused. We should not let water collect around our houses. Mosquito grow in it and cause many diseases like malaria, dengue, etc. You can see the dustbin. Chipko movement. In the 1970s, some contractors went to cut trees in a forest of Garhwal, Uttarakhand. People of villagers near this forest collected there and they embraced the trees. Men and women were ready to defend the trees. This is called the Chipko movement. This movement spread throughout the country. Sundarlal, Bahuguna, Gora Devi, and Chandi Prasad Bhatt are the famous leaders of the movement. You can see the pictures of Chipko movement and Sundarlal, Bahuguna. Tree plantation. One Mahotsav is held in India between 1 to 7 July. This festival was started by K.M. Munshi in 1950. He was a great environmentalist. On this day, people all over the country plant new saplings. These days is marked as tree plantation celebration. Lakhs of trees are planted in this Mahotsav. Other programs to protect trees and give importance to trees are also launched to make people aware of the environment. Valued facts? We should make trees our friends. Awesome fact, some natural energy sources are clean but we do not use them. Let's learn new words. Environment, surrounding, pollute, making dirty and harmful. Now kids, let's remember, all living and non-living things in our surroundings makes the environment for us. Air pollution, water pollution, soil pollution and noise pollution are different types of pollutions. We can take different steps to reduce the pollution. One Mahotsav is celebrated between 1st to 7th July. I hope you all like this session. Now kids, revise what you have learned in this chapter and we will meet again. Till then, bye and all the best.